Okay, this is uh, September 3rd, part two. My video cut off on me. Okay, so again, the excavator had to come back out and dig this line back further because we wouldn't have been able to set the walls. If you look at the stake close to the bushes, that's where it originally was cut to. So they had to cut it back to the uh, stake with the lime green ribbon on it. So we came, dug all this out. The basement jogs over, so the wall will come out to here. It goes up, then it jogs out again. So again, it goes up to right here, jogs over. You can see the orange marks in the gravel. Right with those flags. So that represent the wall, where the wall is going to sit. And they're going to be out tomorrow to install that wall. So I really needed to get that done yesterday. I really appreciate the excavator. So far, I'm really happy with the guys. Nobody uh, had a problem coming back out getting this corrected. Uh, so again, I'm, I'm happy with that. So they got, they'll come back out after the wall is set and they'll pull all this soil so they can start grading out for the garage. Again, where that stake is the rear corner of the garage. That's some extra dirt right there. So, again, this is where the driveway is going to be. So tomorrow, I got the walls coming out and I got the steel beams coming out. So I'm coordinating that where either the wall company or the beam company will set the uh, beams on top of the basement wall. So I'm hoping that they'll actually the wall company will get here before the steel company because if the steel company gets here first, they're going to have to set the beams on the ground and then I'll get the wall company to lift them back up and set them in place just by the guy's lunch. And they'll do that for me. So again, we got all the water and sewer lines in, covered up. So far, again, I'm very proud of this house. We, uh... We're doing it right. So for the first time building, I must admit that uh, very minimum hiccups, but it's going to be a very strong house. So the new owner will be very satisfied. They'll have a house whether they know it out, a very strong house that's going to last for years. We went the extra mile for the uh, putting in the gravel and the uh, number one stone while I got it open I'm even going to build a um, suck pump beneath this so that way it'd be extra security keep, ever keep the basement from flooding so so far everything is good okay so that's gonna be it for this video it's not gonna be much action going on today Tomorrow's going to be a pretty busy day. So I had to call my son, get him started, because we're just about wrapping up that house there across the street. So we need to wrap that one up and get that one on the market.